summer for yeah. sure. Yeah, and we're entering a nice part of the year to start going out to the food carts a little yeah. more and more. I mean, yesterday we saw some gorgeous weather uh, where we hit the upper 60s. We'll talk about those numbers in just a moment. This morning, though, we're still under some fog and some clouds. It's a gloomy start here as we kick off our Wednesday. Today also not as warm either. Temperatures in the low 50s as we start. It is a mild morning. There's no need for that heavy jacket out the door. We'll see temperatures also climbing back to the upper 50s to near 60 today, so that's still not bad. Likely a dry start this morning, too. We are awaiting rain, but it uh, more likely rolls in by the afternoon. We'll start to see some light showers back in the picture here. Uh, temperatures again in the 40s to low 50s as we kick off this morning. Not tracking much. It's just cloudy around the valley. Same goes for the coast right now. There are some spots of fog. If you're heading into work by bike, uh, you'll likely see a dry morning. There could be some patchy fog. It's very concentrated out towards the uh, west sides of Portland now to Hillsboro, Beaverton. So keep that in mind, low 50s and a nice cruise in. Take a look at our satellite and radar. There's a system we are tracking. That'll likely flow in here heading into our late morning. So rain back in the picture today. It may ramp up across the afternoon hours, so I would grab a rain jacket, especially if you'll be out this afternoon. Now yesterday was gorgeous. We were advertising some of the warmest temperatures of the year so far. Portland tied the highest temperature we've seen so far this year. That was back in February. Uh, but again, uh, some spots like Eugene, Hood River did hit 70. It was real warm out towards areas of central Oregon yesterday in the 70s, and even the coast got to the 60s. So pleasant nonetheless, and it was just great to get outdoors in that sunshine. So the warmest days so far, we've only topped off in the upper 60s. We also did it back in February, too. And if you remember, if you remember that month was a very dry month. We saw weeks of dry conditions and sunshine. And with that, I, I believe the 11th was a day of record warmth uh, for a February day. So we're now entering the uh, time of the year where we start to see the 70s. If we did see it yesterday, it wouldn't have been too unusual. We typically see our first 70 degree day right around the start of April. First 80 degree day closer to the first week of May. And then the 90s, the triple digits closer to June and middle parts of July. But again, that's not on the forecast for today. We're expecting a cooler day right around normal in the upper 50s to about 60. There's a look at the rain here. This model does show some light showers arriving uh, even across the late morning hours and probably out towards areas of southwest Washington is where we'll see more of that rain falling a little heavier too. there out towards the foothills, maybe near Battleground, Kelso, Longview could see some light showers later this morning. But there's the system that rolls in. It's a weak weather system a weak cold front that'll scoot in and bring us a chance for some scattered rain showers this afternoon. So grab the rain gear. The good news is the system works out the door very quickly. So by the time we hit uh, the evening hours, we're already drying out. We also clear out overnight, so temperatures may dip back into the upper 30s by Thursday. Also, fog likely to kick off tomorrow morning, but we are dry. Just some gorgeous weather as we finish out the work week. So here's uh, today's forecast for the coast. Low 50s, likely rain uh, off and on all day. Cloudy and a bit gloomy. Winds out of the west at about 5 to 10 miles per hour in the valley today. We'll go with highs right around the upper 50s to about 60 today in Portland with those light afternoon showers. For the east side, Still pleasant, not as much rain makes it over the Cascades today in the mountains. So still dry, partly sunny, uh, but a chilly night ahead as we hit the upper 30s. And in the gorge today, the 60s out towards Hood River, upper 60s for the Dalles, a little drier the further east you go. Rain showers also expected for the mountains uh, with that freezing level right around 6,000 feet. So here's your seven day forecast. We'll stay in the 60s and Thursday and Friday, a couple of dry, pleasant days on the way.